Kia ora, my best beloveds. It's Inanga Rose here and we are in the healing room today. And today I want to talk to you about what it means to be a shaman. So, shaman is a Siberian word meaning energy worker. It's just, that's all it means, energy worker. And these are some of the things that are in my uh, sacred objects for me in my room. And we're in this little room in my house. This is my clinic room. And here's a painting of the universe that I made. And up here is a painting that my children's dad put on this room. A very beautiful painting, actually. Um, he's, a, he's a wonderful artist, too. Anyway, I digress. So I just wanted to talk to you about some of the things that happen for as a shaman. So when you do your shamanic training, you will probably end up making a drum. And this drum is the world drum. So when you make a drum as a shaman, you, you have a journey where you, where you lie down and you receive from spirit what your drum is about, what your purpose is for this drum. And this drum is called the world drum. So these colors and these symbols were given to me in my vision. And this map of really, I think it's sort of like a star map, was also given to me in that vision. And each of these little things that hangs on here is very carefully chosen and rechosen and sometimes chosen again um, and remade over the years as I grow. I'm allowed new symbols. And I don't always know what those symbols mean. I just know that that's what I'm needing to have. So this drum is, uh, as I said, is designed to take that which is taken by force. And so it, it removes the energy of that which is taken by force. This symbol here, this, this triangle symbol, is um, has, was given to me when I journeyed once by a elephant. And if we think about what an elephant is, it's a, it's a vast, um, connected being it has deep values, deep family values, it's incredibly loyal. Elephants are a really superior being and, um, you know, they will, they visit their own, oh, anyway, I could go on about elephants, but, so that symbol was given to me by elephants and what it means is the connection to all things, yeah? So this drum is made for that purpose and when you make a drum, you also make a beater and this beater is my drums beater and it's a very odd shape and on it it has some words written it says all the love in the universe is right here in the palm of my hand how do you know that you ask because i put it there i answer and that poem is by jeff rose um and he also wrote this poem we are more than connected with the love that moves the universe we are the very substance of that love Partners in the Operation of the Universe, Jeff Rose. Now, Jeff Rose is a, um, a very strong Christian friend of mine. And some people are concerned that shamanism is not, is not Christian. We have lots of Christians in our training group. I don't consider myself a Christian because, um, because I don't fit in the church very well. It, uh, people are con concerned about me, so I don't... Uh, attend. But interestingly enough, when you do your shamanic journey, um, you are, we go and we seek our spiritual teacher. And my spiritual teacher ended up being Jesus. So through the process of becoming a shaman, I've ended up with Jesus as my spiritual teacher. So I guess I'm more Christian now than I have ever been which is pretty beautiful. And it's funny because lots of the Christians in our training group are quite jealous of me because their spiritual teachers are things like rocks or trees or other things. So it's about what's correct for you. Yeah. And I love to work with the angel Gabriel. And this is, I'll just show you a little bit about the things in my drawers. I've got some special, this is seal skin. And this is a special basket that my girlfriend wove me and some oils and some sacred rocks there. And in this drawer down here, I have um, I have a gourd, which is like a medicine wheel gourd that I, that I grew and that I painted. And I've got my, my rattle and my bells and all the bits and pieces, some sage, 
some things that I might need in my books for um, my clients. And I have some water in a, in a uh, sacred rock. I have... Oh, I've got some beautiful things here. So my rattle, spe special sacred thing, the, the uh, Venus. Here she is. Insects, resin, incense and other things. So each object has its own special place and it goes only where you get taught how to put things where they need to go. And this is my medicine bag. So inside this medicine bag are specific objects that want to work with me when I'm working with a healing sometimes. So each time we're working, I take different tools which are are have have given well, they've decided to work with me. So you know each one has been um, asked and and then the intention is to bring love and to bring light and to bring joy into the world. So that's that's the purpose, love, light and joy. And because I've done lots of homeopathic training, in this drawer here, 